This morning, Florida Supreme Court has cleared the way for a six-week abortion ban, one of the strictest in the nation. But at the same time, the court will allow voters to decide the issue later this year in a November ballot initiative. We know that the majority of Floridians do not want to see politicians interfering in our personal health care decisions. I'm going to continue fighting, you know, um, abortion until it's finally banned here from Florida. The court ruled yesterday that the Florida Constitution does not protect abortion rights. That that allows a trigger law banning abortions at six weeks to take effect in 30 days, banning the procedure before most women know they're pregnant, with exceptions for rape, incest, and the life of the mother. Governor Ron DeSantis approved the ban last year. It was the right thing to do. Don't let anyone tell you it wasn't. Florida is a key point of access for abortion services in the region. When the ban takes effect, nearly all abortions will cease in the southeastern United States. The Biden campaign already responding. We're now going to have a ballot initiative uh, where people are going to be able to fight back against the sort of extremism that continues to play out because of what he did in appointing the justices who overturned Roe v. Wade. Other red states that have put abortion on the ballot, including Kansas, Kentucky and Ohio, have voted to support abortion rights. 60% of Florida voters need to approve that ballot measure in November to protect abortion rights in the state's constitution. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.